Hello everybody. So today I will talk about calculus. The topic today is about differential equation. So now I will show you how to answer. We need to divide both sides of the x. So we know that this is about homogeneous. So we can use about y equals to vx. So if we do first the derivative for the both sides, you got about dy over the x. If we do first the derivative of v, you got about dv over the x multiplied by x. If we do first the derivative of x, you got about one. That means you got about v in here. So y equal to v x, we change for y. dy over the x, we change for this one. So we see that we have x, x, x. We divide both sides by x. Next, number 1 will go to the right. And you got about negative number 1. Next, we divide both sides of v minus 2. So this one, we just open the parenthesis. This v in here will go to the right, and you got about negative v. Now we need to do about common denominator. So we have negative number one. We put in here. And we put negative in here. This one we need to expand, and you got about negative v square plus two v. Negative number one with this one we combine together, and you got about negative v square plus two v. So this one we can write like this. This is about identity. So you got about v minus one to the power of two. Now this one go to the left, the s and s will go to the right. So we got about v minus 2 over v, v minus 1 to the power of 2. And we have the negative sign in here. And we got about dv equals to dx over s. Next, we need to put the interaction for the both sides. Next, about number two, we can separate them into negative number one, negative number one. So v minus one divided by v minus one. So you will got about one over v minus one minus one over v minus one square. And now we got the final answer. The integral of 1 over v minus 1, you will got about ln of the absolute value of v minus 1. The integral of ne negative number 1 over v minus 1, 
to the power of 2, you will got about positive 1 over v plus 1. The integral of, of this one, you got about ln of the absolute value of s, and we put about c about v. That's e about this one. So we divide both sides by s, and we put this one to replace for v. This is the end. Thank you for watching.